In better days, the melting pot was sealed tighter than the skin on a squirt. Or squirts. I feel so evil now. That's just a slot in the face Of all the plans to survive the calamity, it had to be stab weeds. Blasted things hurt like a broken heart. If there's a core, he figures it ought to be deeper down. Stuck inside one of those fancy cages. No break in a cage like that, but the kid tries anyway. Gotta find a way to spring it open. Throws a switch. <clears throat> now what could possibly go wrong? Famous last words. Quite a bit, as it turns out. The cage starts lifting from the core ever so slow. All kid can do is wait. Shipments start falling in. Not every squirt's born bad. Some spring to the kid's defense. Judging by the movement of the cage, it's gonna take a little while. Scumbags don't take kindly to interlopers. Even some gas fellas take his corner. Heard it pop that mean old foreman. At this rate, maybe five more minutes, maybe thirty, hard to tell. Squirts get real territorial around the core. Then a ship and a free sample shows up. It ain't all bad as the kid finds some 
spicy. Tax free. One thing's for sure. That cage is awful heavy. It's a troublesome scene to be sure. left and the core goes free. Ten, nine, eight, seven, give or take a few seconds. Finally, the core's within reach. And done. He's got it. Just gotta get to the nearest barge. Across the boundless sea to found Ceylandia. It was good living here for a while. <coughs> yeah, the old world's finished, but the new world's just getting started. The Bastion's a place of peace, but we can hold our own if we have to. Army carbine. When I was a fighting man, I used the very same. Okay, this one. I already know what's gonna happen here. Hmm. Alright, see you in the next part.